Now, first alert weather with Chief Meteorologist Tom Messner. I know it's starting to feel like winter can't be far away, but we're not talking about a lot of snow, but actually maybe a couple of snowflakes, the highest of elevations in the Adirondacks tomorrow morning, but that's not going to stay. Hang on, we'll get back to that for you in just a minute. Storm Tracker picking up a bunch of rain. It's all very light stuff and it's just kind of coming and going. You know, periods of rain, you're seeing a little bit around Rutland. You can go down to Bennington a little bit, up toward Middlebury. Almost anywhere you look, you're going to see a dot or two on the weather map, right along the northern tier of northern New York and into Vermont as well. We've got an area of low pressure that's coming on through. With that, we're looking at periods of rain tonight into the beginning of tomorrow, and then it's going to get out of here. Meanwhile, over Plattsburgh, check it out. I love the way we've got a little bit of rain around. We've got low clouds. It's making things a little bit brighter out there. It looks kind of cool on the camera. Just 49 degrees in the Berg right now. We've got 40s all over the place from the Northeast Kingdom to the Champlain Valley. 43 right now, Saranac Lake down in Keene. It's 46. This will not surprise you too much, but we're looking for light rain showers, periods of rain right through the overnight into the beginning of tomorrow before the rain does work its way out of here. Now, the other thing about tomorrow is we've got a brisk northwest wind. It is going to feel very chilly. Want to show you the future cast wind gusts seven o'clock in the morning. We've got gusts in the teens. We'll take you right through the day and you're going to notice it all day long. So highs tomorrow, low 50s. It's going to feel colder than that. Watch what happens later tomorrow night into the beginning of Saturday. The wind is dying off and that's going to be the case for Saturday. But with the light wind by then clear sky, oh my, Saturday morning is going to be cold. It's going to be clear. It's going to be cold. Look at these temperatures expecting frost all over the place. There's a freeze watch posted already and just check it out temperatures in the 20s. So Saturday morning is going to be cold. What about the rest of Saturday? Well, it's going to be sunny. We'll call it cool by the afternoon. Mid 50s, great looking day. And then Sunday, more clouds around by the afternoon with a high of 62. The chance for a few late day showers, but I wouldn't change any plans. Now for tomorrow, you know, I mentioned it's going to be a cool day. We start in the 40s, low 50s. That's the best we're going to do, but I know it's going to be windy. The clouds at least giving way to some sunshine as we get you into the afternoon. All right, future cast. Look at the rain that moves out tonight. Oh, I talked about the highest of elevations in the Adirondacks. Maybe a few snowflakes on top of Mount Marcy, maybe on top of Whiteface. But first thing tomorrow, showers in the lowlands. They give way to at least some sunshine by the afternoon. Then we clear. Here's the cold Saturday morning. The day itself is looking pretty good. Saturday night giving way to clouds by Sunday morning and then Sunday clouds thickening up late in the day. We could find a couple of showers around. So periods of rain out there tonight. Temperatures not that cold. Not like it's going to be tomorrow night. We are talking about lows in the 40s. Then tomorrow, 80 morning showers giving way to at least some afternoon sunshine. Look for high temperatures, upper 40s and the low 50s, but with the wind, it's going to feel colder than that. All right, so a few morning showers tomorrow and then a little sunshine later in the day. Saturday looks great. A few late day showers on Sunday, 62. So it is going to rain Monday. Showers are still possible on Tuesday and then Wednesday, Thursday look good. Friday looks good too. Just so you know, a week from this weekend, at least the chances there for some showers.